Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. Kanju Yulo in the chat room here at live.perillo.com, and you'll have to pardon me if I mispronounce that. It's kind of a weird name. I was just asking a question, how can I add more USB ports to my PC? And uh, there is a way to do it uh, that is quite simply adding a, another card, a PCI card, to your system. Uh, this is something that I had purchased a, a while ago. It, it, it's, a, it's a PCI card that has five USB ports on the, ba on the back of it. Just put it in an empty PCI slot and I was off to the races. In fact, if Lord Cat is still here in the chat room, he inherited that USB card. Uh, those are USB 2.0 ports. Um, you know, that's one way of extending your system. Uh, you know, what's so disappointing from PC manufacturers is that the USB ports that they put in the front of the computer sometimes aren't USB 2.0 certified. They're only as fast as USB 1.1, which is far slower than USB 2.0. Uh, another way, of course, adding USB ports is taking one of those ports and then plugging a... Let's see if I can get to it. No. It's a USB hub to it, and USB hubs come in... Uh, here, hang on. Pixie, let's show them. Here, Pixie, you entertain them. Do the song and dance. Hello, my baby. Hello, my darling. Hello, my right time gal. Send me a kiss by wire. I'll leave my heart's on fire. If you refuse me, honey, you'll lose me. Then you'll be left alone. So call me and tell me I'm your own. Thank you, Pixie. Thank you. I appreciate that. Uh, here, these are all my, my USB things here. I got a lot of USB crap here. Right? Look at that. I got tons of USB. Uh, USB crap, look at this. I got tons of junk here with USB stuff, uh, including uh, an AMD hub. It's got four USB ports on the back. Uh, they hand these things out for free everywhere. Uh, and AMD is a sponsor of our, our videos. Huh. Imagine that. That's kind of weird. Um, anyway, uh, this, these are my, this is my USB dreadlocks. Uh, I've, uh, I got them styled at Great Clips. Uh, of course, uh, you can you know get a discount if you just mention my name the next time you go in. Uh, and now, if I if I plug if I plug one of these things into a, a port or a hub, uh, maybe you know something wacky will happen. Um, yeah, that's the easiest way to expand your system with USB is to add an external uh, USB hub. They're relatively affordable, and sometimes they're even free. Uh, and that being said, you know my monitors have got USB ports on the sides. Uh, my keyboard, the aluminum keyboard, has got USB ports, which is nice. Um, that's that's great when you buy peripherals that you you know you have installed anyway. If they have USB ports, it's a great way to expand your system. I think theoretically, you can have up to 127 USB devices plugged into the same computer. And we've talked about the uh, program before. It's a free program for Windows from Nearsoft.net, N-I-R-S-O-F-T.net called USB DE View, uh, and it, it will allow you to manage the uh, USB devices on your machine, making sure the drivers are all working properly and whatnot. Uh, it's, it's one of my favorite USB management utilities, and it happens to be free. So yeah, I love USB devices. Um, you, you saw me in my blog the other week linked to the USB humping dog. Uh, what's the wackiest USB device you've ever seen, or that you own? Maybe maybe you don't haven't just seen it, you actually own it. <laughs> I'm a sucker for USB. I tell you, I love it. I love it. I love it. Ugh.